Hey guys, XA from Ace5 Studios, and today I'm gonna answer the question on what HPB is because you see it, people mention it, and nobody knows what it is. It's a mystery. Nah, I'm kidding, people know what it is. And I'm gonna describe it here. So when you have an object, you'll see it has rotation values in HPB, and also down here you have rotation in HPB. What is HPB? Well, it's from the aeronautical stuff where airplanes have a heading, a pitch, and bank. So basically you have, I made this little nice handy thing. When you turn to rotation, you will see that basically when you move it like this, you're affecting the P, which is the pitch, which is which way, which is how far the nose is pointing. And if you're at it this way, it's the heading of the plane because it's this horizontal axis. And B is the banking, which is when it tilts on its side. And you can see here the B changes. This is not super logical because in 3D, things aren't always pointing this way. But if you want your pitch and bank and heading to work as expected, make sure your object is pointing in the Z direction the, along the blue axis. It has a forward point. And then you'll be able to remember these is this way. Otherwise, you'll just have to rotate it and check which one changed. Not the most intuitive method of doing this, but that's what we live with. So yeah, super fast tutorial, but hopefully it helps when you think of it as an airplane. It would be easier if it was just, this is the X rotation and this is the Z rotation, but alas, we don't have it. Also, how this is the Y rotation, but for some reason it's the top, whereas the X rotation is second. So it has its issues, but this is what it is. Um, you can change your rotation order here to X, Y, Z, which is um, possible, but this doesn't work well with frozen coordinates yet. So be very careful with it. Sometimes when you freeze coordinates, it all goes to, to, to a bad place when you reload the file. So be very, very careful with this. If you find that your animation project is having problems and loading and things being offset, it might be because you're using a different rotation order and freeze transformations. There you go. Hope it was helpful. Hope this will make your life a little bit easier. Don't forget to check out my website for free rigs and more free tutorials and some premium rigs. There's an arms and legs pack, which is fun to play with. I'll see you next time.